everyone. Welcome to the Horror Realm. I'm Travis Bruce, and today we're still in Fan Appreciation Week. I just posted another video, so make sure to watch that. So the question I was asked, they heard me talk about crappy food or no food at horror conventions. So the question was, the ones who do serve food, who has the best food? So I'm not going to answer that question. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to answer that question, but I'm going to answer it indirectly. So... Are we talking just about horror conventions, or are we talking about nerd conventions? So that's Comic Cons, anime, wrestling, all that stuff, right? Elf. Is, if you're a horror fan, you're a comic fan, and you're probably a wrestling fan. I feel like all of that nerdum fits in one box, right? So if, if we stick with that, it is 100% BlurCon. Um, that's B L E R D, Black Nerd Convention. And it happens every year in either DC or Virginia. Literally the best food. Like, by the way, it, they call it BlurCon, but it's like 80%, it's only like 20% black people there. Like, every it's white and Asian. Um, weird, right? Um, but they have the best food. And the reason why they have the best food is in their parking lot, they have like 20 freaking food trucks. You can literally walk out. To the parking lot at any break point. Oh boy, I'm tired from getting autographs. Let me grab something to eat. You don't have to get in your car. You don't have to go to the nasty hotel and eat the nasty microwave food there. You know, you, you're not like at the, um, what's the one in Pennsylvania? The Oaks Ex Fan Expo and eat that nasty crap. No. You go, out to, oh, you go out to the parking lot and there's 20 food trucks. Last time I was there, I had pho. Like pho, sushi, Japanese. Mexican, soul food, vegan, whatever you want. I don't know why why horror conventions don't follow. Comic cons are kicking horror conventions' asses when it comes to food. They really do. Food trucks, food trucks. Now, if you ask me what was my favorite horror movie, I mean horror convention food, it would have to be Day of the Dead. Um, but you gotta get that VIP pass to get that little buffet. And I don't know if all of the data is. I only been to the one in Indianapolis. And the buffet was pretty good. It was decent. So, all right, guys. Well, thank you for the question. And thank you for coming to the horror room. I'm Travis Bruce. Uh, please hit that like and that subscribe button. And hit that little bell for, I, I, for notifications. I post videos daily. All right, guys. I'll see you next time. Thank you.